Hi children, today we are going to learn about money and the content standard, financial resources and savings, and problem solving. By the end of the lesson, pupils will be able to identify financial resources and savings, record savings and expenses from the final resource, financial resources, solve daily life problems involving addition and separation of money. Okay class, how can we get money? There are many ways to get money. You, uh, you can get money from Duet, Hai, Duet Raya in any festival celebration. You also can get money from grandfather, grandmother, or relatives. You also can get money from sales if you help your mother and your father sell something like ice cream or cake. You also can get money from gift that you win at any competition that you participate at school and you also can get money from your mother or your father a pocket money okay look at this saving money Limi want to save some money because he wants to buy a wallet. So Li Ming draws a table. At 10 March 2017, his grandmother gives him 10 ringgit. Then he spends 5 ringgit to buy a storybook. At, at that moment, he has 5 ringgit. So at 16 March 2017, his mother gave him pocket money for 90 cent. Now he has 5 ringgit and 90 cent. Then he spent 40 cent to buy a bread. And the balance of his money now is 5 ringgit and 50. Sorry, 5 ringgit and 50 cent. 5 ringgit and 50 cent. So at 24 April 2017, Li Ming sold things and got 5 ringgit. So the total of his money is 10 ringgit and 50 cent. Then he spent 1 ringgit to buy an ice cream. Ice cream, 1 ringgit. So his balance of his money now is 9 ringgit and 50 cent because 10 ringgit and 50 cent minus 1 ringgit and the balance of his money now is 9 ringgit 50 cent. Can Lee Ming buy a wallet? No, for at that moment he cannot buy a wallet because he, his money is less than uh, 50 cent than the price of the wallet. Okay, class, we go to problem solving of money. Look at example one. Kim buys a ruler and an eraser. Find the total cost. One ruler or each ruler is 50 cent and eraser is 30 cent each. So we have to write in number sentence first. 50 10 plus 30 10. Because we want to find the total cost. So write in standard return method. 50 cent above and 30 cent below. Put the symbol of addition here. And 0 plus 0 is 0. 5 plus 3 is 8. So, the answer is 80 cents. Okay, look at the second example. 
read together, Arisa has 55 cent. Pefe has 25 cent more than Arisa. How much money does Pefe have? So, we have to write the number sentence first. 55 cent plus 25 cent. So, the method one, write them in standard written method. 55 cent above and 25 cent below. So, 5 plus 5 is 10. 0, you write at 1 cent and 1 at 10 cents. So, 5 and 1 is 6 plus another 2 is 8. So, the answer is 80 cent. <clears throat> okay, method 2. Look at the coins. 55 cent and 25 cent. 55 cent plus 25 cent. 50 70, 75, 80. So, Fefe has 80 cent. You can look at example 3. Ramu donates 5 ringgit. Kamal donates 5 ringgit too. Calculate the total amount of money. Total amount. So, we have to add them. 5 ringgit plus 5 ringgit. So, write in a number sentence, 5 ringgit plus 5 ringgit. Method 1, you write them in standard written method like this. 5 ringgit plus 5 ringgit is equal to 10 ringgit. Or method 2, 5 ringgit not for Ramo and 5 ringgit not for Kama. 5 ringgit and 5 ringgit also makes 10 ringgit. So, the total amount of money is 10 ringgit. Okay, class, look at example 4. There are many things here with their cost, their price. So, look at A. Farah has 80 cents. She buys stickers. Stickers. Find amount left. Stickers cost 70. And so, write the number sentence first. 80 cents minus 70 cents. First one. We want to find the amount left. So you write down in standard return methods. 80 cent minus 70 cent. So 0 minus 0 is 0. 8 minus 7 is 1. So the amount left is 10 cent. Okay, look at B. Find the difference of prices between chain and cap. Kitchen 3 ringgit, cap 6 ringgit. So the difference is 6 ringgit minus 3 ringgit, right in numbers and number sentence. And you write down in and written method 6 ringgit minus 3 ringgit. So the answer 6 minus 3 is 3 and unit of RM. So now 6 ringgit and 3 ringgit. Minus 3 ringgit is 3 ringgit. Difference of prices with between kitchen and cap is 3 ringgit. Okay, example 5. Saiful has 10 ringgit. He donates 4 ringgit to the poor. How much money is left? So, this is subtraction 2. Apple has three, 10 ringgit, donates 4 ringgit. So the number sentence can be right is 10 ringgit minus 4 ringgit is equal to it. Okay. Solve, in, solve them or arrange them in standard written method. 10 ringgit above and 4 ringgit below. So... 10 ringgit minus 4 ringgit is 6 ringgit. The answer is 6 ringgit. It has 6 ringgit right now. Example 7. Read together. Ying has 10 ringgit. Wafi has 2 ringgit less than Ying. Calculate Wafi's money. So we also have to subtract. 10 ringgit and 2 ringgit to find office money. 
So first write in number sentence, ten ringgit minus two ringgit. Write in standard written method, ten ringgit minus two ringgit. So ten minus two is equal to eight. The unit or the symbol is RM. So office money is eight ringgit. Okay, look at question seven. Adip has eighty cent in his money box. He puts in twenty cent more. What is the total amount of Adip's money? So the number give number mathematics is given here. Eighty cent plus twenty cent. So we write in standard written method. 80 cent plus 20 cent. Zero plus zero is zero. Eight plus two is ten. So the answer is 100 cent. Okay, 100 cent is equal to one ring eight. One ring eight. So 80 cent plus 20 cent. The total amount of this money is one ring eight. Okay, question 8, Aini has 25 cents, Isha has 65 cents. How much more must Aini save to have the same amount? So the number mathematics is given 25 cents plus what is equal to 65 cents. So we solve them, write them in standard written method. 25 cents plus what? is equal to 65 cents. Okay. 5 plus what is equal to 5? 5 plus 0. 2 plus what equal to 6? 2 plus count on 2 until 6, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So there are 4. 4 put here. So the answer is 40 cent. I, I need must save 40, another 40 cent to the amount of Isha money. Okay. Okay, class, that's all for today. Thank you for watching and listening to this video. I hope you enjoy.